Peace and love, peace and love, peace and love from your favourite Beatle, Ringo Starr. I play the drums and that's about it. Ringo Starr, one of the last Beatles left alive, and I don't mean the band the Beatles, I mean the insect. What do we know about Ringo? He plays drums. He really loves peace and love. He lives under the sea, presumably in an octopus's garden. That's how the conspiracy theory goes. But what's the one thing re everyone really wants to know about the Ringo Starr? I don't know, really. But what I do know is his Instagram account is... very weird. See, most celebrities have Instagram accounts, and they're normally run by, you know, their marketing manager, or their, you know, PR rep, whoever it is. And normally the posts are coherent, and it's like, oh, I, I, get, I get what this is all about and stuff. But Ringo... I think he runs his own Instagram account, and I'm going to show you why. So right off the bat, we're here on his page. And of course, the uh, top thing in his bio is hashtag... Nice! Hashtag peace and love, and all these random emojis. Some of them make sense. You know, you got the peace sign, you got a heart, you have a... Rhinoceros. Some of them make sense, but not all of it. <laughs> so right now, we already have a very un unhinged gif of Ringo where it just looks like he's screaming, smashing his face into the camera, and then keeps walking and doesn't realize he hasn't stopped recording. <laughs> and the caption is, should I do it? I, I'll do his accent for now. Man, I- INCREDIBLE! Keep it up! I'm not gonna do his accent, I lost it. And the caption just reads, Man, I am having a wonderful day, hanging out, hanging out, peace and love. Emojis, which include blo broccoli. From here, you can just go on and assume, oh, well that's kind of strange, I guess, you know? Um... No, all his posts are like this. It's very strange. I, I like this picture he took, because it's like he's taking a picture of the... What is that? The caption reads, I'm having a great time in the studio. I love my bass drum, Mike. I'm in the middle of an EP, Peace and Love. Uh, the emojis this time include a carrot. So it's very obvious that he just writes his own Instagram captions, and I don't think there's any marketing agent or PR representative that's screening these before he posts them. It's It just ends up being very hilarious and very inadvisable from a marketing standpoint. But people love it. Look, 57,000 likes. What does the top comment say? One of the comments says, This is so hot. I can't handle it. Neither can I. Ringo is kind of hot. <laughs> Another comment that says, Mike, Mike, <laughs> Mike the bass drum. I guess his bass drum is just named. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was autocorrect. I love my bass drum mic, as in M-I-C, like the microphone that's hooked up to my bass drum, not my bass drum, comma, mic. When I get a drum kit, I'm going to name the bass drum Mike. Ringo's bass drum is called Mike. Confirmed. This adds a lot to the Beatles lore and really gets into the Paul McCartney is dead conspiracy theory. And right here we have another very strange photo of just Ringo from the 60s standing in front of the United States of America with his hands up in the air. Like he's about to give his inaugural speech because he just got elected president of the United States. All the caption reads is, I love America, peace and love. According to the legend on this map, uh, it turns out 100% of the United States voted for Ringo Starr as president. So I guess um, we have the wrong guy in office. Hashtag Ringo is my president. <laughs> I've also noticed a very strange trend on his page where he posts pictures of like deer and elk. The first one I noticed, it says, who is that looking in my window? It's a beautiful day, peace and love. I should probably mention that this isn't a deer, it's a beautiful day. On this next one, we you can also see another beautiful day right here, and it says, Oh, it's you, Ringo, peace and love. I think I think he's actually giving the deer narration this time. He's giving them voice lines. And then right after that, two days later, another picture of a deer. Wow, look who's there, peace and love. Uh, well, this time he says, peace and love, peace and love. That's what Ringo does. He really just loves saying peace and love. We have another kind of strange one here. It's just him <laughs> giving the peace sign at the camera. A little too close to the camera for my liking and like going back and forth. It keeps looping and it's kind of creepy. I thought there was like a, a song or something going in the background, but there's no sound. It's just this and the caption just reads, it's all happening, but have a great week and peace and love. Another broccoli emoji. Shout out to the broccoli emoji. I think I think Ringo just really likes broccoli. I think he just really likes broccoli. Look at this Thanksgiving picture. The happy Thanksgiving, everyone have a great day, be safe, peace and love, broccoli. I just had a stroke reading this caption. So he's holding up a looks like he's holding up a picture of 
a book he released. I haven't read this book. I don't know if it's good. But the caption reads, Peace and love, everybody. I'm having a fine Saturday getting ready for Super Sunday. Getting ready for Meat Free Marvelous Monday. Peace and love. I wonder if he actually means Meat Free Monday. Like, he doesn't eat meat on Mondays. Or if he just doesn't eat meat at all. I don't know if Ringo's vegetation... Ringo's vegetation. <laughs> Ringo's vegetation. Vegetation Ringo. And some of his more recent stuff was interesting, too, because... So this is really funny. He was... I think he was on Jimmy Kimmel recently. The original caption was... Did he delete it? I think he might have deleted it. No, wait. Here it is. So he was on Jimmy Kimmel Live, and the original caption read, Another great night with Jimmy Kennel. Peace and love. Jimmy Kennel. Like a dog kennel. And everybody was commenting about it in the comments. And here's another one, because I think I autocorrected again in this one. And it originally said, heading into the studio to hang out with Jimmy Kennel. Show peace and love. Thanks for the good time, Jimmy. It's good to laugh. Broccoli emoji. Shout out to the broccoli emoji. In this, in this post, he's wishing David Lynch, the guy, you know, the guy, David Lynch, a happy birthday. And in the next post, it's, I don't know, it's, it's Ringo handing David Lynch a cake, I think. The caption just says, blow out the candle, David. Blow it out with peace and love. Face and love. The caption has such a threatening aura to it. I'm really wondering what Ringo's motives were with that caption. Blow out the candle, David. Blow it out with peace and love. Blow it out. Blow out the candle, David. Blow out the candle. Blow out the candle. This post I've never understood. It's, it's a wall art of Ringo looking deformed. That's, ring that's radiation poisoning Ringo right there. And all the caption says, as somebody said, Ringo back to the dingle. Ringo back to the dingle. What's a dingle? Shout out to dingle. And here's where things begin to collapse. Ringo is venturing into the world of fictional art and fictional currency. NFTs. Not even Paul has stooped to that level, Ringo. What are you doing, man? NFTs. NFTs with lots of peace and love. Which I think this one was written by a marketing manager because the caption is actually kind of comprehensible. New day, different time of day. Um, new shirt, new album. Go stream Jackpot Juicer. It is a great album. I wish this was a joke, what I'm about to say. But Ringo Feet Picks just dropped. He's celebrating the physical release of Peter Jackson's Get Back documentary on, you know, DVD and Blu-ray, I guess. And he's taking a picture of it on his floor, and his feet are in it. And this has 135,000 likes. And then the exact same day, he posts another one. Another picture that's just his feet. It's a sad day when a Beatles starts posting feet pics on their social media. This just goes to show you that Ringo has absolutely no filter and doesn't seem to really care what he's doing. So, yeah, I just wanted to say that. Oh, I think that's gonna do it for this video. I'm done. I can't stand any more Ringo. This video is just kind of unscripted and stuff. I don't know. If you want to, you can subscribe. Just be sure to subscribe down below with some bice and love. And be sure to comment below bice and love if... <laughs> If you like the video, be sure to smash the like button with lots of bass and love. And yeah, do the things that um, you like. Do stuff, but not drugs. Don't do drugs or else you'll end up because your Instagram will look like Ringo's Instagram. Okay.